Welcome back to the Sonic 06 playthrough, part, um, uh, 14, whatever. We have to do Touching the first trial of Stiliana, which involves jumping through warp holes to find the exit, and it's kind of a bitch to do, because you kind of forget. I actually make it to, like, the fourth one, the last one, then I screw up, and, oh yeah, that sucks, because it, you clearly went through the warp hole there, but it just didn't work out. Touching a Much like most of the concepts in this game, it just didn't work out. And then I forget which one to go through here. And oh lord. Let's actually go through it this time, and... Maybe the end? Oh no, but you missed the spring, you retard. So we have to do this whole thing over again. Throughout the whole way, forgetting which portals to go through. So, essentially it's just the same thing over and over again. What are you doing, you fool? You fail! You're back at the beginning, or at number two, or whatever. You fail again! You're back at the very beginning. I, I get really sick of hearing that. Touching the warp hole will send me away in a flash, because you hear it over and over again, it's driving me crazy. Every time you screw up, touching the warp hole will send me away in a flash. Oh, we did it again. It seems like, you'd think like after three tries, I'd figure out which hole is the right one. He was sticking his head through the wood there, which is kind of crazy. Oh lord, oh god, I fail at life. Ha 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 ha. And I forget again, don't I? Nope, I did it. I don't fail at life, surprisingly. Do we do it? Do we get it? Do we get it? Tell me that's right. Yay! We don't fail after all. It only took me two minutes and there's another loading screen. They have to load like the actual freaking... The trials are really, really, really bad with loading screens. You've proven your intelligence. How does jumping through warp holes make you intelligent? Pronouncing that. Man, today's not my day. Man, today's not my day. I suck at remembering things. I love how like the S, A, B, and C are like all shiny silver, and like the D is like a hunk of concrete. Uh, that's kind of funny to me. It means you fail. You failish failure. So we gotta complete their other trials. This next one, the trial of, ooh, excuse me, the trial of courage makes you take on a bunch of robots with no rings, which I guess is kind of courageous. It's also kind of stupid, but <laughs> since when has the line between courage and stupidity been, you know, marked well anyway? Either way, we have to learn what to do, and then another loading screen. Har har har. But you know, um, this one is kind of a bitch because it's it's really easy to die, and then you have to go through like two loading screens before you can get back to the place where the trials are, and then you got to go through two again to get back to the level. Lord, it's horrible. But I don't die, which is good. good. I really don't have to go through like four loading screens just to get back to the level. That's like two minutes right there. We need loading screens around 30 seconds at the most. I think the longest one is around 30 seconds. Anyway, we're defeating invisible robots because they have cloaking shields now. The guys that shoot the. I don't actually think they're in there. I remember them being in here, but I don't think they are in here. But those guys are a bitch. If they were in here, that would, this would be bad. The guys that shoot the bullets are like, ridiculously hard to avoid. You know what I mean. And the way he stands on those branches is just stupid stuff. Oh yeah, you're gonna want to have to defeat. You're gonna want to defeat all the enemies really fast so they don't get a hit off on you. This guy in particular, he shoots out like freaking lasers, so you're gonna want to kill him fast. Where are we next? Um, whoa! Hello. More robots! Shoot 
exploding missiles. Yeah, those kind. Those guys are bitches. Those guys are the bitches. If you're not fast enough, they'll shoot one of those things at you and you will die. That guy's kind of a bitch too, because he has like a homing laser. So you're gonna want to kill him fast. Pretty much you just gotta be as fast as you can. It's like the test of speed. More than it is a uh, test of courage. You've proven your courage or stupidity. Yeah. Move on to the last challenge. The last challenge is kind of weird. It's re it's really easy, but it's also kind of weird. Too easy. No sweat. <laughs> Too easy. No sweat. I heard, I heard this that if you pick Amy here, it's the trial of love. You basically have to pick between Amy or Elise. I heard that if you pick Amy, you fail, but that's not the case apparently. Because I do pick Amy because I'm not a fan of bestiality. Sorry, people. Hey. If you are, keep it to yourself, please. I don't want to hear that kind of thing. But yeah, it basically tells you to choose between Amy and Elise, and the obvious choice is Amy, because, you know, long-time lovers or whatever. <clears throat> even though even though Sonic and Elise get more uh, time together than Sonic and Amy do, Amy just basically saves Sonic's life, and then... You never see her again with Sonic at all. She spends more time with Silver than she does with uh, Sonic. So we're moving on to the Trial of Love, and if you do not get an S rank here, you are v either very indecisive or just not looking at the screen or whatever. <clears throat> Overcome the test of love, so should we choose Amy or Elise? Um, I think the choice is obvious. You'll choose me, won't you, Sonic? I'll be waiting over to the right. Of course you will. Sonic, you came! That's nice. Um, so we're gonna choose the person. Hey. We're gonna run around a bit. Is Amy really the one? Yes, she is. The test of love. I heard you fail if you pick Amy, but you don't, so. Rest assured, people, you do not have to choose bestiality. You've chosen your long time, love. That's your choice. I'll respect that. Your choice will support you throughout the upcoming battle. Except it won't. It has no impact on the game whatsoever. 22 seconds, that's a new record. Not really. Like I said, it's so ridiculously easy to get an S rank here because... It only takes like 10 seconds. Unless you're like, oh my god, Amy or Elise, Amy or Elise, but I don't know why you would be, because the choice is obvious. It's choosing between bestiality and not bestiality. What would you choose? Don't tell me, please. I, Like I said, I don't want to know. Hey. Especially, if, especially if it's the first choice. But enough of that, we have to <laughs> let the freedom, Eagle of Freedom and America the symbol of America, and it's carrying us to the place we need to go. And then the eagle just disappears. How the hell did Tails get up here? What the fuck? Why didn't he have to go through the trials? That's ridiculous. That's redonkulous. Oh god. Seven robots. Sonic cannot handle this alone. What's this? Silver has come to save the day! Because Sonic could not handle like six robots. And I really love that because it's just all slow motion and awesome. You look like you're in a hurry. So they act like nothing happened. It's like, on? oh hi. We've been friends for a while. It's not like I tried to kill you or anything. They just act like that never happened. I need to rescue the princess. <laughs> Alright. He just act like Nothing ever happened. They're like best friends now. Oh, I saved you from six robots. Can you be my friend? <laughs> I don't have any friends. <laughs> no one likes me. <laughs> and with that, join me again in part uh, 15 for Kingdom Valley. One of my... It's an alright level. Anyway, see you later.